here's a way how you can get Mugen add characters and stages to it as well okay first we need to get Mugen for that uh, you should navigate to this web page I'll link it in the description select M-U-G-E-N Mugen and download the stable version I use the development version as well but it has much more bugs than the stable version so I would recommend you downloading the stable version let's download it download and download in whichever direct directory you want I'll be using the desktop at this moment for this tutorial but you can download it wherever you want okay we got it first we need to extract it and again you can extract it wherever you want I'm just extracting it on my desktop yes, okay great let's delete this file we don't need it anymore and this is our Mugen folder it contains Mugen software let's run Mugen exam and you will see that this is Mugen and it works let's see what's in here training as you can see there is only one character or two if you if you will count the low and high quality versions of this character and there is only three stages okay we're gonna change we're gonna change this now first let's download the characters you can download the characters from a Mugen Wikia this page I'll link it in the description as well navigate to Mugen and select characters and download whatever or whichever character you want let's select characters and let's select let's select Patrick okay great now let's this is the download links all of these are mirrors original version 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 one okay there are a lot of versions but I'm gonna download the original version let's download and free download okay while it's downloading I'm gonna show you where do these characters go uh, the characters go in this folder charts and the stages go into this folder and we should uh, add uh, this file we should be, uh, we'll be adding this file okay let's download this on my desktop or wherever you want and as I've said you'll extract it as you can see Patrick in the character folder charts folder okay and let's open chart uh, Patrick folder and you will see the def file def file this is the name we need to copy and it, it, it doesn't show the full name or if you do it, it doesn't show the extension file extension here file name extension as you can see it's a DEF file you can copy you should be copying the full name but if you can't see this the DEF extension name you can write it as the end I'm gonna show it first we let's let's copy the Patrick or whatever the name is we need the DEF file again I'm gonna emphasize on this DEF file you'll be copying the name of the DEF file let's copy it and write it in select data and select this is what you should open you should open it with your text editor I'm using notepad okay scroll down and find 
uh, insert your character below and this is what you should do okay let's press enter here add the new line let's paste let's put a comma here let's put a space here let's put another uh, let's paste it here again oh no 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 still is this and let's press save to ages and make sure that uh, it's exactly as this is you can just copy this and paste it here and let's put this and let's put the Patrick name and let's put the DEF at the end again remember when I said that this is a D DEF file DEF file and its full name doesn't chose here because the extensions is not enabled if you enable the uh, name extension it will it shows that it's a DEF file dot DEF file okay and let's save it file save close it and we should have our new character set new character added let's run let's select arcade and as you can see we added Patrick just so okay let's select Patrick round one fight okay. yeah, so. Zone. Okay, let's add another character so you can see the how it goes. Let's add a new character, Mugen stages characters. Let's add uh, I hate link. Okay, let's add video game characters. Okay, let's add video game characters. Let's add. Uh, Let's say the Scorpion. No, it needs something fun. Let's say the uh, Peter Griffin. Let's say Peter Griffin. Okay, again download. Next. Well, I don't know. Let's download this version. Where's the download? Download, download. Peter, download. Here it is. Okay. I think. Let's download the final version. Again, let's download it. Save it on the desktop or wherever you want. Okay, where is it? Parks. Here it is. Let's extract it in our. Uh, Let's extract it in, it in our charts folder. Let's open it. Let's select, find the, our DEF file. DEF file. Let's copy this. Copy. And let's edit the select file again. Let's find the insert new characters below. Add new line by pressing space, paste, put a comma here, then type the changes, make sure that it's exactly the same as above, I mean the capital letters and everything. Let's put this here, and let's put this dot def. Let's save it. Save, and let's, let's start the game. Let's start the game. Let's see if this works. As you can see, it worked. I don't know how do I select it like this. What are you, high? Round one. Fight. Fight. Ah. Anyway, now let's add a stage. Okay, as you can see, it's very simple. Now let's add a stage. Let's go back to our wiki page. Move in and stages let's select this stage this looks interesting let's download it okay let's skip this and i'm lost already let's find a different thing to download let's download uh, 
Let's download this. No, no. Let's download this. You see the rain. That sounds interesting. Uh, let's download it. Download. Select the folder we want. Save. Okay, let's close this and even delete it. Okay, we will delete it. Okay, let's see. We don't need this anymore. Okay. And here is our folder. And as I mentioned, we need to extract it in a different location. We need to extract it in stages. And let's throw it here. And let's again select the DEF, see the DEF file. Copy its name. Copy. And select, uh, find a select folder. Data select folder and navigate to extra stages below here we gonna here below here we gonna put a space here name then we gonna uh, oh, first we need to write stages like this stages then we gonna put this you can copy this and paste it here then we're gonna paste the name of the DEF file and put a stop and DEF save it save it start moving but this stage didn't have sound I'm gonna try to find a stage that has sound and show you how it works as well how you should edit as well training okay let's select this and let's as it on as you can say we will add that a new stage. Round one. Fight. Okay. okay, great. I'm gonna finally find the stage that comes with an audio track. And uh, oh no. Oh, and uh, and show you how you should add uh, the audio tracks as well. As it's kind of seen. Something interesting. Let's 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 download this. Mm -hmm. Let's hope that it comes with this audio track as well. Mm -hmm. Save wherever we want, and let's open it. And no, no sound. So I'm gonna ignore this. I'm gonna. I'm gonna find the track that has sound. Where are these tracks? This is a, so let's hope this has at least some media fire. I think that think that stage has a sound. And come on today, download. Okay, I'm in the Okay, and uh, here's the sound. Let's start it as you can. It's just a sound. okay, great. And first, we need to extract the sound in sound. Let's extract it here. Sounds. Remember this music? Okay, you remember it? Okay, great. And uh, let's extract these two files DEF and SFF in our stages location stages and again let's find the DEF file copy its name and find the data select navigate to the extra stages put a new line here write sta stages slash whatever it is let's paste the name dot def let's save it file save and let's start again let's start okay team this is survival training let's select okay oh no okay 
Okay. You can see the sound is here. Okay, that's it. Thank you for watching. It's as simple as this. Subscribe.